today lecture i am going to factorize x square plus 19x minus 150 so let's see the answer so writing the given x square plus 19x minus 150 so we can easily solve this problem so first term and the last term we need to multiply so writing here x square minus 150 minus 150 x square after that take the middle term 19x okay this middle term taken so 19x we can write 14x plus 5x okay so when you add this two so it's equal to 19x and when you multiply 14x into 5x so it's equal to 17x square so here you can see 17x square and minus 150 it's both are not equal both are not equal so that it's a rejected we cannot use 14x plus 5x after that the next is we can write here 19x we can also test 15x plus 4x so here it's equal to 19 and if you multiply for 15x 4x so here it's equal to 60x x square so 16x square and 150 both are not equal so it's a rejected we cannot use 15x plus 4x now the next is trying with another so we can write 19x 24x and here this 5x okay so 25 24 minus 5 that is equal to 19 and if you use 25 into 25x into minus 5x and if you multiply so here this equal to x square and here 22 and this here 120 so the value come minus 120 okay so minus 120 it's not both are not equal so both are not equal so it's a uh, rejected we cannot we cannot use 25 4x minus 5x now like this uh, we need to check another number so this time going to use here 25x minus 6x okay so if you subtract it's equal to 19x and when you multiply 25x into minus 6x so it's equal to here minus 150 x square so 150 x square both are equal so both are equal so we said use this 25 x minus 6 x combination into this equation so this accepted so writing here x square 25 x minus 6 x minus 150 now x take the common so here x plus 25 and next is minus 6 is the common so x plus 25 okay 25 25 is the common between these two so we can write x plus 25 and here x minus 6 so this is the answer of this question okay so here x plus 25 x minus 6 so this twos i taken x common because x is there and this twos minus 6 common so x plus 25 here x plus 25 is the common between these twos take the common here you can get x minus 6 so this is the way we can do the factorization of this equation so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see next to it thank you